G'day Marshmallows and welcome back to the Kogo Couch. We are watching Rise of the Guardians. Lots of suggestions from people in the comments to watch this one. And I was looking at Christmas movies online and I realized that this was one of them and I was like, huh, I really love DreamWorks. So I'm gonna be not surprised at all if I really love this film. It's very nostalgic to me watching animated films and it's just a good time, it always is. So without further ado, let's jump into it. Oh, cool. Mate, DreamWorks makes some awesome intros, don't they? I love that most of them are so unique. My favorite is definitely the How to Train Your Dragon intro, though. Oh, actually, maybe Megamind. Darkness. Whoa. That's the first thing I remember. It was dark, and it was cold, and I was scared. Then I saw the moon chase the darkness away. Dude. I wasn't scared anymore. My guy just spawned out of ice. <laughs> I love when movies make the moon look bigger. It looks so cool in these movies. Dude's got ice powers. Oh, that's so cool. I love that they're making it look really magical, like not just some devastating power. This is DreamWorks' Elsa. <laughs> oh. Oh. That's awesome. Can he fly? Or was he just like using wind or something there? Uh, dude, you're gonna freak some people out. <laughs> Hello. Oh. Oh, uh, excuse me. Ooh, shivers. Yeah, Hello? right. My name is Jack Frost. Oh. The moon told me so. Okay. That was all he ever told me. I mean, I'd probably believe the moon if it told me something. 300 years later. <laughs> Whoa. That is intricate. That is so cool. Obviously, this is Santa. That is incredible. No! He opened it so violently, too. A dude has a sword. <laughs> oh, what does this mean? Oh, that's not a good sign. <laughs> oh, that's oh, that's so creepy. Can it be? Dingle, make preparations. <laughs> Dingle. <laughs> This is so creative. Already, I'm like blown away by just how imaginative this film is being. Oh, the tooth fairy. Wait. Hold up. <laughs> There's so many of them. They look like little birds. It's her first tooth. Look how she flossed. I see. That is super interesting. Look at her. Half bird, half person. It is our job to watch over the children and keep them safe. I have called us all here for one reason and one reason only. That's obvious, Sandman. I love the way that they're representing these characters. They seem so cool. We alone can stop him. Well, that's obvious too. The Easter Bunny, right? <laughs> oh, it's freezing. Wait. <laughs> Hold on. I feel my feet. I can't feel my feet. <laughs> is he an Aussie? <laughs> the boogeyman was here at the Ooh. pole. Pitch? Mr. Oogie Boogie? Hold on. I thought you said you saw Pitch. Not exactly. Not exactly? Can you believe this guy? That's got to be Hugh. You summoned me here three days before Easter because of your belly? Easter is not Christmas. <laughs> oh. Let me guess. He thinks Christmas is way more important. Pitch went out with a dark age and we made sure... Oh, wow. That long ago? I've got this. Guys, I've listen. <laughs> oh, the poor thing. Man and moon, Sandy. Why didn't you say something? Bro, <laughs> you were arguing. What is big news? I love Santa. He's so cool. The fact that he's a Russian. It is pitch. <laughs> My gut told me. Ooh, that looks magical. He's choosing a new guardian. Manny thinks we need help. So they've already got magical beings around the world. Jack Frost. Well, I, I... Oh, they all got a crush. <laughs> he doesn't care about children. All he does is freeze water pipes and irresponsible, selfish guardian. 
Yeah, that's the way it is. So why doesn't he qualify, huh? No. Oh. Because I've always been interested, right? Whenever I hear Jack Frost, I do think trouble, you know? I mean, look what he's doing. That was fun. Hey, wind, take me home. Right, so he does use the wind to fly. That's cool. Look at all the chaos he's creating. I know he's invisible, but the sort of disruption he's causing is like there's an entity around. You saw the video too, Claude. He's out there. The Easter Bunny. The Easter Bunny is real. Real annoying, real grumpy, and really full of himself. <laughs> <laughs> Has Jack Frost met some of them? We don't want Jack Frost nipping at your nose. <gasps> Who's Jack Frost? <laughs> Did that feel real? <laughs> <laughs> Who threw that? Wait, oh, what? It wasn't Bigfoot, kiddo. Did he just make him do this? <laughs> <laughs> All right, who needs ammo? <laughs> That's so cool. Wait, so he doesn't just have ice powers. He can manipulate people's feelings? <laughs> I hate cupcakes. <laughs> ah. <laughs> nice. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Look at that! I know he just caused so much destruction earlier, but look at the amount of fun he's causing. Oh, don't worry, Jimmy, I got you. Hold on! Let's give me our- Uh, Jack? This is real. He could die. Oh my god. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, there you go. Okay, nice. Land in snow. Oh my god! Whoa! Okay. Did you see that? It's not under <gasps> <laughs> Cool, a two! Two Oh no. What about all the fun we just had? That wasn't the two- Oh. The guy gotta do to get a little attention around here. Oh, this poor guy. Yeah, he's been invisible for 300 years, right? Spreading so much joy and he just wants to be noticed. Truth came out. All right, Yeah. The chaotic energy coming from this girl. Oh, that's cool. Well, he made someone really happy. No one ever sees me. You put me here. Least you can do is tell me, tell me why. That's interesting. I think he'll get the answers he needs in a way he doesn't really expect, you know? Not as direct as you'd like. Right on time, Sandman. Oh, wow. Do adults get dreams? Where's the cutoff? <laughs> when they turn 18? <laughs> uh... I thought I heard the clippity clop of a unicorn. He's so creepy. So full of hope. Why, there's only one thing missing. A touch of fear. <laughs> that never gets old. What a pretty little nightmare. Oh. The wait is over. Oh, look how dark this guy is. My nightmares are finally ready. Are your guardians? Does he have like... The same powers as Sandman? Is that how that works? His is just motivated by fear. Hello, mate. <laughs> Been a long time. <laughs> Easter Sunday, wasn't it? He has a boomerang. Hey! What the hell are you? What the? <laughs> oh, that's cool. They got portals. Not on your Nelly. See you back at the pole. <laughs> that's cool. <laughs> leaves a flower. I love the these iterations of these different characters. They're all so cool. I love them. Especially the Easter Bunny. But that's a biased sort of opinion. Jack Frost! You gotta be kidding me. I love being shoved in a sack and tossed through a magic portal. Good. That was my idea. <laughs> Hello, Jack. I've heard a lot oh. about you. Are they really as white as they say? Yes. Oh, they really do sparkle like freshly fallen snow. Girls, pull yourselves together. Wow, big fans. Mm -hmm. I must have done something really bad to get you. <laughs> Am I on the naughty list? Ah, on naughty list. You hold the record. Ah, uh. <laughs> you are guardian. <laughs> the spectacle. He organized all this just for Jack. <laughs> what makes you think I want to be a guardian? <laughs> of course you do. <laughs> No uh, music! Uh, uh, he put his heart into that. You're all hard work, deadlines, and I'm snowballs and fun times. Well, maybe that's why you're needed. Each of those lights is a child. We protect them. Tooth, fingers out of mouth. Oh my goodness. They're beautiful. 
Okay. No more weekly work. You were chosen like we were all chosen by men and moon. Yeah, there you go, mate. You see, you cannot say no. It is destiny. Exactly, and you wanted to talk with the moon. After 300 years, this is his answer. Spend eternity like you guys thinking of, of, of new ways to bribe kids? No, no. <laughs> Jack. Not for me. No offense. How, how is that not offensive? <laughs> <laughs> What's this clown know about bringing joy to children? Ooh. Uh, yeah. The kangaroo's right. The, the what? The kangaroo's right! I'm not a kangaroo, mate. Oh. <laughs> what are you? I'm a bunny. The Easter bunny. People believe in me. Damn! They're arguing, but the Easter bunny makes it so personal, man. Cuts right to the heart. I was like the elves made the toys. Just let them believe that. They're just there for moral support. Take the red! Water! Oh, dude, really? Okay, so Yetis do all the toy making. And I'm guessing Santa does all the designing. Fruitcake? No, thanks. Tax of breasts. Oh my gosh. Who are you? What is your center? You must have something very special inside. I love how curious this Santa is. But if you get to know me a little, well, go on. <laughs> this is interesting. You are downright jolly. Onions have layers. And fearless. My center. There's a baby. Big eyes because they are full. Oh. Eyes that have only seen the wonder. I love that. This wonder is what I put into the world. That makes total sense. It is my center. To be that self-aware and to know how to use your deepest core trait to help other people. That's great. We have a problem, man. Trouble at the Tooth Palace. <laughs> I can't get over it being here. <laughs> There's no way I'm climbing into some rickety sleigh. No. Oh, let me guess. It's really awesome. <laughs> wow, look at that. Okay, one ride, but that's it. Everyone loves this land. I think my tunnels might be faster, mate. Get in! Oh! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where are the bloody seatbelts? <laughs> I love him! <laughs> yeah, Jack Frost would love this. He's all about that fun time. That's so cool. Yeah, I guess the Easter Bunny would, would hate flying, right? Since he's always down to earth. I hope you like the loop de loop. I hope you like carrots. <laughs> this is the coolest Santa. Hey, bunny, check out this view. <laughs> oh, you do care. Uh, rack off, you bloody show pony. <laughs> what? I love that he isn't just Aussie, he's saying all this Aussie slang. <laughs> Uh... Oh! Hold on, they're eating them? Hey, little baby tooth, you okay? Oh, That was so cute. Yeah. Dude. They're stealing the teeth! Oh, is he trying to sabotage tooth fairy collecting stuff? They took my fairies and the teeth, all of them. This is very, very exciting. Oh, boy. I'm a little starstruck. <laughs> Did you like my show on the globe, North? Who's the voice actor? He sounds great. I want what you have to be believed in. Baby, I'm tired of hiding under beds. Oh, that's what Jack wants. Go suck an egg rabbit. Oh. Hey. Look familiar, Sandman. It took me a while to perfect this little trick. Turning dreams into nightmares. So these powers that he have, they're only recent? The Dark Ages. Such happy times for me. The man in the moon chose you to replace my fear with wonder and light. Nice. Meanwhile, everyone wrote me off as just a bad dream. There's no such thing as the boogeyman. So dude wanted to be noticed just for how evil he is. Children are waking up and realizing Tooth Fairy never came. Aww. Oh, but to a child, she's so devastated. If enough kids stop believing, it all goes away. And little by little, so do they. No Christmas or Easter. There will be nothing but fear and darkness. Dude, I'd be a guardian just to get rid of this guy. Dude is pretty scared of those boomerangs. <laughs> He's 
gone. So I'm assuming that he is far more powerful than they really understand, perhaps? You should have seen them. They put up such a fight. Mm. Why would Pitch take the teeth? It's the memories inside them. The memories? Mm. They hold the most important memories of childhood. And when someone needs to remember what's important, we help them. Oh. Yours too. I, my memories? Before you became Jack Frost. I wasn't anyone before I was Jack Frost. Oh, so he didn't just spawn. What? You should have seen. Wait, so that whole monologue at the start about seeing darkness, that was actually after his life? If I find my memories, then I'll know why I'm here. Maybe there was a good reason why I can't remember. We're too late. No, no, no such thing as too late. <laughs> yes, come on. We, we will get you your memories. She's all used to stamina. They work hard on one day. I'm in. Let's go. <laughs> I love Santa, man. He's so cool in this. He's so like hopeful and like so smart. You might be able to keep up anyway. Is that a challenge, Cottontail? Oh, you don't want to race a rabbit, mate. <laughs> oh. <Yeah. laughs> They're definitely going to become good friends. It's been a really long time since I've been out in the field. 440 years, give or take. <gasps> Damn. <laughs> oh. Ah. Ah. Does their maturity stop when they turn into their magical self? You're a bit of a brumby, eh, hey, mate? Nah. <gasps> <gasps> whoa, whoa, whoa! whoa. Take it, he's one of us! Part of the European division. Dude, she beat him up! Ho, ho, ho! Oh! <laughs> that was great. You guys collect teeth and leave gifts as fast as my fairies. You guys have been leaving gifts, right? No. That's the whole point. Oh, that's great. <laughs> that had to get changed. Nice. Well done, Guardians. Why aren't they going out? You failed. Have your last hurrah. Or tomorrow, all your pathetic scrambling will be for nothing. Oh, boy. This was always the part I liked most, seeing the kids. Why did I ever stop doing this? A little different up close, huh? Thanks for being here, Jack. Aww. Let's just get you taken care of. It's Pitch's turn. I love that. They're becoming really good friends, these two. Check it out, Peter Cottontail. Now that's a bag of choppers. Gentlemen, <laughs> Yeah, Jack's forte isn't exactly collecting things. It was. I win. Yeah. Ah, of course Santa wins. Ah. <gasps> oh, no. <laughs> I mean, this is a good thing, right? Surprise! We ah. came. <laughs> you can see us? Most of us. Oh. Do you know what greyhounds do to rabbits? It's a pretty safe bet he's never met a rabbit like me. And the ancient uh, Crikey. <laughs> <laughs> My gosh. <laughs> oh no. Oh. Goodness me. Okay. The chaos. Whoops. <laughs> well done, guys. Look what you did. Oh boy. Sandy, come on. We can find pets. Oh, I don't know. This is the perfect time for him to do something because they're all knocked out. Wait. <laughs> this girl. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> She's so chaotic. Ah. No! <laughs> no! No, 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 <laughs> Oh no. This is not good. Things are getting so complicated. <laughs> I got it. That's cool, he can freeze him. Whoa, the way it's like frozen into the floor. For a neutral party, spend an awful lot of time with those weirdos. Hmm. <gasps> he got so scared. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh. That looks dangerous. Oh. 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 Damn. Remind me not to get on your bad side. Yeah, for real. Oh, there's so many of them. What the heck? Ooh. Oh, gosh. <laughs> okay, thank you. Thank you. They're coming to help. Thank you. Oh, barely. <laughs> so this is the real fight. Good. Whoa, look at it go. I love that they've literally turned these characters into the Avengers. You might want to duck. <laughs> oh no. Is no one around? No! 
Wait, that's it? <laughs> Don't fight the fear! I thought he'd last a bit longer, you know? What the heck? I'd say sweet dreams, but there aren't any left. No! Sandy? What, for real? That's it? <laughs> oh, gosh. Uh, buddy. Buddy. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. Hey. Okay. How did you do that? I didn't know I could. Okay. Maybe he's got a little bit more in him than he knew. Someone who knows how to have a little fun. It's a shame they couldn't finish him off then. He seemed way more vulnerable. <sighs> Poor Sandy. What now, man? Kids only have nightmares? It's like without a single one of these guardians. Every child's life is like way worse. I don't know who you were in your past life, but in this life you are a guardian. How can I know who I am until I find out who I was? The past is what makes up who you are, but you don't need to know what made it, you know? We can still turn this around. Easter is tomorrow. Nice. I say we pull out all the stops and we get those little lights flickering again. I mean, this should be easier, right? Since he does this normally by himself. Shostakovich! Oh. <laughs> that is awesome, he's got tunnels like this. Welcome to the Warren. I love how easily Jack is just on board with everything. He just loves the fun. <laughs> uh. Oh! <laughs> Sophie? Crikey, somebody do something! Dude, the amount of Aussie slang they're shoving into this movie. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah? Okay. Come on, man. Oh, he's made the Guardians more fun, too. I love that. All right, troops, it's time to push back. Eggs <laughs> everywhere! Every time one of these scenes happens where Jack Frost is like, what are you guys doing? This is how you communicate with kids. I'm like, somehow this relates to defeating the boogeyman, but I just don't know how, you know? And I'm bringing hope with me. Oh, I love how joyful he is now. Because so far, he's only really been annoying <laughs> to Jack, but it's good to see him in his element, actually enjoying. I love to see how happy he is. Not bad. Not bad yourself. There we go. I'm sorry about the whole, you know, the kangaroo thing. It's the accent, isn't it? <laughs> he also looks like he's been designed to have the shape of a kangaroo. How about I take her home? Jack, no. Trust me. I'll be quick as a bunny. Yeah, I don't know, mate. Ooh. <laughs> Kids, man. <laughs> what a crazy day for her. That voice, I know that voice. This can't be good. Is it like a siren? <laughs> Whenever they're separated, the boogeyman makes his move, you know? Don't worry, there's, there's still time. <laughs> She's like, this is the start of a horror movie, stop! <sighs> this is so obviously a trap. Baby, dude, baby, dude, come on! I have to find out what that is. Is this his lair? Oh, this is where he took all the tooth fairy little bird thing? Don't be afraid, Jack. I'm not gonna hurt you. Afraid? I'm not afraid of you. You are afraid of something. Yeah, that's his job. Yours is that no one will ever believe in you. Oh, he knows. Well, fear not, for the answer to that is right here. He's so good, isn't he? You're afraid of what the Guardians will do. Dude, he's just playing with your mind. Jack, what did you do? What do you mean, what did he do? What could he have possibly done? Happy Easter, Jack. Wait, what? Where the hell is he? Yeah, I oi. checked everywhere. There's nothing. There is. There's no such thing as the Easter Bunny. Oh, they can't see mm. him. Easter no. Easter. Wrong. Not not true. Right in front of you, buddy. Oh. They don't see me. Oh, that would cut real deep. Jack! Where were you? I mean, that's all that Jack's known, but... The nightmares attacked the tunnels. Every basket, nothing made it to the surface. <gasps> Where did you get that? Where's Baby Tooth? Oh no, this looks terrible. You were with Bitch? I'm sorry. I didn't mean for this to happen. He has to go. We should never have trusted you! Oh my gosh. Easter is new beginnings. Easter's about hope. And now it's gone. Oh. 
and you only get one chance a year to Hey, he's probably not going to get a chance to be seen for another year. Oh, I know Jack stuffed up, but they just put a lot of pressure on Jack just then, you know, like it was all his fault for not being there with them. You should be happy you still get dreams like that. And not oh, nightmares. This kind of reminds me of it. <laughs> Those kids must be miserable, man. Only having nightmares. Well, at least there's one kid that still believes about all of them, you know? Except for Jack Frost, right? <laughs> Dude went all the way to Antarctica to just yeet this thing off a cliff. Well, you have it now. You might as well look at it. I understand. <laughs> you don't understand anything! I don't know what it's like to be cast out! Yeah, they're like the same. To not be believed in, to long for a family. Don't listen, Jack. He is what you could become. Look at what we can do. We'll give them a world where everything is pitch black and Jack Frost. <laughs> they'll believe in both of us. No, they'll fear both of us. Yeah. Baby no! two. Stop. Stop, Jack. You have a bad habit of interfering. You know he will. That's all he wants to do is just to get rid of Jack. He doesn't want him on his side. Now let her go. No. What? Uh. Uh. Damn. I mean, I'm assuming he has like superhuman sort of durability, but because a normal person would have just died. <laughs> oh, the sneezes are cute. Oh. Well, no time like the present. Come on, mate. Yeah, come on. I love how excited the little bird is too. Of course, he was doing all this stuff. Just look at me. Jack, I'm scared. Oh, shoot. We're gonna have a little fun instead. You're gonna be fine. You have to believe in me. You have to believe in me. I love that. One. Whoa. Balance your weight out. Oh, gosh. Three. Okay, at least the ice is thicker there. That's it, that's it. Three. Ah! Nice. No, 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 no. Yeah! Wait, that was it? Oh my gosh. So he died, or he was dying. So he died protecting his sister, was it? I saved her. <laughs> that's why you chose me. I'm, I'm a guardian. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Normally I'm reluctant to, you know, accept a narrative where it's like, you need to know the past to accept who you are, but it, it works in this context, you know? That was super important for him to know. <laughs> oh. <laughs> there we go. I thought he was going to need some duct tape. Let's go! <laughs> We're getting a lot of superhero moments in this movie. Nice. My guy spent so much time finally making them all red. Only six left. <laughs> nope, you still got that kid. You still got that kid that they saw. <laughs> now you look like a fool. And he's American. America! <laughs> you and I are obviously at what they call a crossroads. Oh, we've all been there before. <laughs> As kids. This is me after seeing Toy Story for the first time as a little kid. I believed in you for a long time, okay? Just a little sign so I know. Oh. I knew it. These poor kids, their lives look so bleak now without the Guardians. Yes, that's a brilliant idea. <laughs> oh, that's so wholesome too, the way he's making uh, a kid believe in another Guardian. It's so selfless. He can do that? <laughs> <laughs> He's literally doing what Sandman can do, but in reality. Jack Frost. He knows! You said... <laughs> he can see him! You said my name! <laughs> can you hear me? Can, yeah. can you... Can you see me? He sees me! <laughs> Remember when you went flying on that sled the other day? That was you? That was me! That's awesome. Every one of us 
is real. I knew it! That's so cool. Jack! Uh, Jack! You okay? What are you doing here? Aww. The last light. Look at all the color that's faded from them. Jack, he sees you. <laughs> Losing Easter took its toll on all of us. Bunny, most of all. <gasps> oh! Oh! <laughs> now somebody sees me. I mean, where were you about an hour ago, mate? Me and you. Come on. <laughs> he told me you were real. He made you believe in me? Yeah, buddy. Yeah, thanks, mate. Ah! All right, here we go. Final showdown. It doesn't work on me anymore. What do you mean it doesn't work anymore? How do you just not make it work? That was good try, Jack. A forever. <laughs> <laughs> All this fuss over one little boy. I mean, that's kind of crazy that he could defeat him earlier, you know? 1v1. If you want him, you're going to have to go through me. <laughs> Look how fluffy you are. Yeah, he's pretty cute. I'm scared. Here we go, come on, find your center. We're gonna have a little fun instead. Yes! That's my center. <laughs> He's like, what are you talking about? Do you believe in the boogie? Ah! <laughs> 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 now let's go get your friends. Let's go. This is perfect, defeating the boogeyman with fun. <laughs> You're not scary, mate. <laughs> let's go. Yeah, that is a perfect way to make them believe in him, because it's impossible. Come on, we need your help! <laughs> is that enough kids, though, to make this work? Oh, Woo, shoot. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> Me too, kid. What? Who will protect you? Come on, Jamie. I will. Yeah, Jamie! I will. I will. I will. Let's go. And me. Uh, I'll try. Good on you, mate. Because it's the kid's belief that gives him power, right? Oh, dude! These are some brave kids! I do believe in you. I'm just not afraid of you. <laughs> Wait. Hold on. Isn't that Sandman's powers? Ah. All their powers and color. Yeah, come on, come on. Oh, crikey. Ah, too late. <laughs> ah. Good day, mate. <laughs> Let's get up! What are the kids gonna do? Oh, okay. Is he still too powerful? Ho, ho, ho! Ooh, nice. This is great. This is literally an Avengers moment. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Oh, we backstabber. Let's go. Come on. Come on, Sandy. So how did he come back? <laughs> Was it just the kid's belief? Yeah, dude got wiped out. There we go. Yeah, because his dreams would really be the thing that brings them their beliefs back, right? And memories. <laughs> she finally got her giant unicorn. <laughs> Am I watching Jurassic Park now? Mate, if these parents knew what was going on, they'd be freaking out. <laughs> you want to send them? It took a while, but I figured it out. Oh. <laughs> You're on our naughty list. <sighs> yeah, they just don't care anymore, hey. Having too much fun. You dare have fun in my presence. <laughs> I am the boogeyman. You ain't nothing. <laughs> no. That's surprising. I thought they'd still see him, you know? Because they, they believe in him, don't they? They're just not scared of him. You didn't even say goodbye. A quarter. Oh. <laughs> that was great. And that's for my fairies. 
There will always be fear. As long as one child believes. We will be here to fight fear. And what are they doing here? Just give up, mate. It can't be my nightmares. I'm not afraid. Oh. Looks like it's your fear. They smell. Oh. 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 Dude's own weapon he created turned against him. How poetic. Bye-bye. Well, that's haunting. <laughs> okay. Then it's time you take oath. Will you, Jack Frost, bow to watch over the children? Guard them with your life, their hopes, their wishes, their dreams, all that mm -hmm. we are. I love that this is taking place on the ice, you know, where he became Jack Frost. A guardian. Well done, mate. Are there any rules about dating co-workers though? Because that might be an issue. <laughs> Keep it together, girls. Whoa, I see that? Everyone loves this life. Except for him. Happy Easter, you little ankle biter. <laughs> I don't think I've heard that, you know, like in my life, ankle biter. But what if Pitch comes back? What if we stop believing again? You tell me you stop believing in the moon when the sun comes up. Yeah, exactly. We'll always be here. Kind of makes you a guardian too. Mate, Jamie's the real hero of this movie for believing even after everything. Jack! Yeah, mate. A real kid is able to hug you. That must feel pretty good after 300 years. Pretty much isolation. My name is Jack Frost because the moon told me so. So when the moon tells you something, believe it. Oh, okay. Aye, aye, Captain. <laughs> Nice. That was a that was a really good movie. Was not surprised. I mean, it's DreamWorks, right? They do such a good job with these sort of movies where they just do so well with really imaginative ideas like this, like it, illustrating it in a way that's just so colorful and alive. I also like how at the very start of the movie, one of uh, the first words you actually hear Jack Frost say, I think, uh, in the present is, "Now that was fun," and I was just like, "It's just, it's so." obvious throughout the movie so many times the way that they deal with problems is by having fun and it takes them so long to figure it out it took me a while to figure it out so well that's another dreamworks movie i love that was really really good i had a great time watching it it wasn't like too complicated but it had enough good ideas in it that kept me really engaged it was just so creative it's always one of my favorite parts when I watch these sorts of films at the start of the movie when it's setting up a story. I always love exploring the the different ideas that they come up with that actually set up the rest of the movie. Oh, that's what Santa looks like. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, this is Sandy. This is the Tooth Fairy. I just love those parts of movies, particularly with this one. Just discovering these ideas and the way that a studio is able to illustrate these people it's it's just great no really good i love the character jack frost it's super interesting i i really appreciate that they made the villain sort of an equal person to him like i love that they made pitch jack frost in a sense but if he went south you know i really i think it was a good way to go about it having the main villain his main desire is to be seen by others but he uses fear to achieve it it's the way Jack Frost could go in the future. But I love that the moon was able to choose someone that could literally be a reflection of pitch, but turning it into something good. I think that's a perfect way to defeat the evil in this movie. And it also shows just how much good pitch could have done, but he didn't anyway. I wasn't particularly sure what pitch was like before he got those powers because he said that that was something he recently learned how to do was turning dreams into nightmares is the whole sort of power he had which was kind of like using sand and manipulating it to create things was that only something he just recently made and if so what was he like in the dark ages was he able to do that sort of thing or was he just kind of you know he could only really teleport and manipulate people's nightmares was that it I'm just very curious as to what it would look like in the Dark Ages with just him, you know, how terrifying that would have been. And also, another thing I was really surprised about was the whole thing between the Tooth Fairy and, Fr and Jack Frost. That kind of came out of left field a little bit. I wasn't really expecting it. I think at the start of the movie, it kind of looked like she was more obsessed with his teeth. 
and you know, the little birds were just crushing on him. I was like, oh, okay, this is just one of those things. But at the end of the movie, I was kind of like, oh. You guys let me know in the comments what you think about that. To me, it looked like it, the movie was setting up something to happen further down the track and it just kind of left it up to the audience to decide. Like, it's just mystery, you know? It's like, oh, that could go somewhere, but we'll never know. That's kind of how I interpret it. But yeah, I really liked it. I just, I thought it was very wholesome throughout the movie how out of all the other characters, Jack Frost and Tooth Fairy had some really vulnerable moments with each other where they were able to share the way that they felt. And I just, I really liked that. He had a couple moments with the Easter Bunny, but that felt more like enemies turning into friends, you know, where him with the Tooth Fairy, it just felt like a much deeper sort of friendship. And at the end, it was like, ooh, could it be something else? I couldn't help but notice that just because the movie makes you go, oh, <laughs> where'd that come from? But yeah, I loved it. I had a great time. I hope you guys did too. Please like and subscribe and I will see you all next time. Stay cozy.